Hello and welcome to, the, to tutorial 14 in Microsoft Visual Basic .NET programming. And today we're not really going to learn any coding, we're just going to learn a simple a simple feature that you can add to your application which is called a splash screen. It will appear for a few seconds when you load up the application. It's like an intro page and then your application will load. It's, it's pretty useful to know and not a lot of people know it. So go ahead and make a new project and call it Splash Screen. Okay, so on it doesn't really matter what we put here. We can just add a progress bar, radio button. Oops, that. Let me start the Windows Media Player. And then after this, just go to Solution Explorer on the right and then up here where it should say splash screen it depends what you called your project well if you call it splash screen it'll say splash screen if you call it something else that's what it'll say it doesn't matter just right click it then click add and then new item so here you will have the visual studio install templates just click on splash screen and click add leave it a splash screen one okay so here's what your splash screen is going to look like so just click on the text here feel free to customize it We'll just add splash screen app for the text and we'll leave everything as it is. Then go back to the solution explorer, <coughs> right click splash screen and then go to properties. And then near the bottom here you should see splash screen none. Just click the drop down and click splash screen one. And then we'll hit play. Here's our splash screen. And then there's our app. That's just how a splash screen works, just to show a splash screen before your application. Could make it nice and flashy, design it, and then just customize it however you want. So if you have any questions about this, then just leave a comment, I'll be happy to answer. If you have any suggestions about how I make my tutorials, leave a comment. And also, if you have a request of a tutorial you want made, leave a comment too. So rate the video, which is down here and subscribe up here for more tutorials so thanks for watching see you next time